Hello, Cancer. Thank you for tuning into my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support, and I send it right back to you guys. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. Spirit of love and light, truth and clarity, what messages do you have for a sign of Cancer? Please and thank you. Messages for a sign of Cancer. Please and thank you. So Ace of Wands starting out. So you guys may feel like the surge of energy, uh, feeling more motivated to do certain things here. There's this passionate new beginning. That's the energy that you currently are in. Some of y'all will feel like the surge of like happiness, joy, excitement here. Challenge is the Ace of Swords. Are you being realistic though? So, um, or are you taking advantage of this energy? So some of y'all may be feeling this surge of energy to do something. And with the challenge being the Ace of Swords, either you're not being honest with yourself about something or you're not utilizing this energy or this opportunity for your advantage. And they want you to be mindful about that. Let's see. It looks like some happy times in the past. So some of y'all could have been celebrating some news in the past, or there could have been a lot of like events where you were getting together with friends and family, just celebrating and having a good time. Two of Cups, you guys have true love. That's the energy that's coming towards you is a true love connection. Love is, is equal give and take. Let's see, what are you releasing? What's the energy that you are releasing? Queen of Wands. Some of you guys could have been dealing with someone who's very manipulative, always poking their nose in your business or poking their uh, nose in business that doesn't belong to them. Someone who may be struggling with insecurity, unless some of you guys, this is what you're releasing from yourself, if it's not a person. Why is this, why is the Queen of Wands what they are releasing? The Chariot. Some of you guys could have been dealing with a Leo. The Chariot is your energy. Some of you guys view I want, let me dive more into the Queen of Wands. I want to know if this is your energy or someone else's. Ace of Cups. Either this is someone who offered their love to you or you offers your love to this person, but you're moving on from this energy. You're taking your you're taking your power and your control back is what I'm getting. Why the chariot? The King of Wands. Yeah, some of y'all could have been in a commitment with this person, but it turned out to be something very lustful, something very superficial. You guys didn't have enough in common. There could have been a lot of chemistry initially, but it looks like that subsided the more you got to know this person or it just wasn't enough chemistry for the two of you to stay together. Um, I definitely am getting that you guys are in this energy of taking your power back, taking back your authority, um, and you're determined to move on is what I'm getting. Like you've turned your back on this situation with this person. Quite possibly this is someone that you offers your love to and you're just in this energy of being determined to move on. You feel like this person has distracted you long enough and you're wanting to you're wanting to focus your energy towards your dreams, your desires instead of on this person. What is this guiding them towards? What is this energy guiding them towards? 
some of y'all is part of the reason why you have true love coming in because you guys are releasing the energy that just wasn't benefiting you in any sort of way five of swords yeah you doing what's best for you which is allowing room for room for you to invest in new things here with more potential let's see who or what is on cancer's mind temperance some of y'all have a sagittarius on your mind someone quite possibly you could look at this person like an earth angel they like to keep the peace in the situation someone that you may view as being well balanced they could be a little reserved as well but there's something very peaceful about this person's energy that draws you in that you and like you enjoy to be around them let's see Let's see who's thinking about you. The lover. Someone definitely has love on their mind. Someone definitely views you as their twin flame soulmate. Their divine counterpart here. They definitely feel like two of you share a strong spiritual connection that they can't explain. They feel a stronger connection to you than they have ever felt with anyone else. Tell me more about this situation. Four of Cups. Yeah, some of you guys, like, you have a love offer coming in when you're in this energy of feeling like you're just over love. You're done with it. You're tired of being disappointed. What is your advice for Cancer? Two of Pentacles. Make room. You need to make room for love. So some of y'all, you have everything but love because with the King of Pentacles, the King of Pentacles is someone who's very successful. They have achieved their goals, the goals that they wanted to achieve in their life. So they're basically saying, if you want love, it's time to start making room for it or you better start making room for it. Because it looks like it's coming in with the Two of Cups being the energy that's coming towards you. Give me more about this Two of Cups. Yeah, exploring what else. Some of you guys are definitely turning your back on a toxic relationship and you're headed towards uh, new opportunities in love. I definitely am getting. This is the way, let me make sure it's showing up. So this is the way it came out with Two of Wands. You're turning your back on another situation. I, de I definitely am getting like this is uh, a relationship like you've waited long enough on this person, on a response from this person, or it, you just feel like you've waited to see changes in a relationship and you didn't see what you wanted to see out of this connection. So you're turning your back on it. You view it as toxic as well. So that's why you're exploring other options. I want to see what's this Queen of Wands. Dive a little bit more into their energy real quick. Sudden. You know, I definitely am getting that this person was shocked by you withdrawing your energy. They definitely thought that you would have fought for this a little bit longer. But you didn't. So I definitely am getting like they've been wondering about you. They definitely feel shocked. They weren't ready to give up on this connection is what I'm getting. Give me more about this lover's energy. Yeah, it looks like this is coming in pretty fast. Quite possibly this summer, you guys have this love connection coming in. This true love. Because there's something taking place very fast. I definitely am getting this as someone new. They haven't been revealed to you uh, just yet. But this is someone that you'll feel loved and supported by. Some of you guys may feel like this person puts you up on a pedestal, but you love the attention that you get from this person. So I definitely am getting like there's 
a relationship you've withdrawn your energy from and it looks like it's taking this person by surprise but there's a lot of happiness i mean you got the lovers and the two of cups coming in the form of this new energy this new relationship that's coming into your life so they're telling you to get ready for this let me pull a couple of more cards and we'll close this out Girl talk time with friends. Moving on. Yes, some of y'all are definitely moving on. You're happily single, living in the moment, and just having fun. And then there's someone that you will be talking to. So you have a new love interest that'll be coming in. So someone that you'll be talking to very shortly after embracing singlehood, moving on from another connection. Give me one more. Two more. Yeah, some of y'all could have felt betrayed or there was some deception in this past connection, which either could have, someone could have just been acting out of insecurity, basically is what I'm getting. Or they could have made another person feel insecure. It looks like this new connection will be more lighthearted. You'll have more fun with this person um, versus last connection. It just felt like it was too heavy, way too serious. Um yeah, some of y'all could have felt like you sabotaged this or this person sabotaged this connection. But I definitely am getting like a lighthearted connection coming in for you. That's much easier than this previous connection. But I'm going to leave it there. These are the messages that came through for you guys at this time. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment if this reading resonates. With that being said, you all take care.